The Weald and Downland Museum provided the ideal venue for an exhibition of crafts industries organised by the National Society of Master Thatchers for the benefit of the Prince of Wales. The theme of the afternoon's event was Sustain and Evolve, accepting the need to conserve but to avoid a process of stagnation in the area of traditional building techniques and materials. Escorted by Chairman Rod Miller and Company Secretary Marjorie Sanders, the Prince, well known for his interest in thatching and related building conservation issues, spoke at length to Kate Glover, the only woman actively thatching in the UK. Representatives of the hazel coppice industry, growers of thatching material and custodians of the Norfolk reed beds were also on hand throughout the afternoon. All are areas where conservation needs to walk hand in hand with active management and sympathetic progression into the 21st century to ensure their continued survival. The society takes an active interest in the maintenance and suitability of materials used for thatching, including the problems of longevity and decay. Resident scientist Dr. Roger Angold was on hand to provide His Royal Highness with a background to the research on display. Problems of a different nature were covered by insurance specialist Thatchline, Richard Playle outlining to the Prince the real cost of fire damage losses to the built heritage of the UK and the work being done by the National Society to minimise this. After a busy afternoon session, his Royal Highness received a presentation from the Society's youngest member, Miss Daisy Tozer.